Namaskar and welcome to this channel. Today I am going to discuss about a numerical that is purely related to the drift velocity. And this numerical is very simple. First of all, we try to understand uh, this question. Here in the here in the equations we have given a strip of metal strip of metal that you can see in the figure right here and uh, the strip of metal is 1.2 centimeter wide this is a uh, 1.2 centimeter wide that you can see here this is the y and 1.5 into 10 to the power minus 3 centimeter thick uh, suppose uh, this is a uh, thick and which is 1.5 into 10 to the power minus 3 centimeter and this strip carries a current carries a current of 0 0.50 ampere along its length uh, this is the current and which is flowing through the length of the conductor that you can see here. If it is assumed that the metal contains 5 into 10 to the power 2 electrons per cm cube, that means uh, this is the electron density. Here, here is a cube uh, of each side 1 centimeter, so this is a cube of 1 centimeter in length that is 1 cm cube and uh, this cube contains 5 into 10 to the power 22 electrons and so this uh, cube contains 5 into 10 to the power 22 electrons this is the cube of each side 1 centimeter and this cube contains 5 into 10 to the power 22 electrons 5 into 10 to the power 22 electrons per cm cube and finally we have asked to calculate uh, the mean drift velocity of these electrons we have to find out uh, the drift velocity of these electrons in the questions almost we have given all the value of parameters so we can directly use uh, the Fermat's expression for drift velocity that is i equals vena v e n a vena so from this expressions we can calculate uh, the expression for velocity vd that is i upon e n a if we put all the value of uh, these parameters uh, like current uh, which is a uh, 0.50 ampere and E is the electronic charge and which is 1.6 into 10 power minus 19 column N is the electron density uh, which is the 5 into 10 to the power 22 electrons per cm cube cm cube is the CGS unit so we have to convert it into as a unit so for this I have divided uh, this value with 10 power minus 2 I have uh, done this so this is the conversion of CGS unit into the SI unit right we know 1 centimeter equals 10 power minus 2 meter further the area of cross section and the area of cross section is uh, that you can see here in the figure and which is given by uh, the multiplication of this and this that is 1.2 centimeter centimeter is again a CGS unit so we have to convert it into uh, SI unit so further I multiplied this by 10 to the power minus t and thickness is 1.5 into 10 power minus 3 centimeter again so we have to convert it into a SI unit so for this I have multiplied it by 10 to the power minus 2 
So, if we use a calculator directly, uh, we will finally get this value of drift velocity. So, we have find out uh, the value of drift velocity and uh, drift velocity means the velocity of electrons inside this conductor. Thanks for watching.